weekend? Week. Week. Okay, so number 14, you know? find the equation of the sphere with center 2, negative 6, 4, and radius 5. So just answering that part, we would have 25 equals x minus 2 squared plus y plus 6. Is everybody okay with why this is plus 6? Yep. It's minus minus 6. Yeah. Z minus 4 squared. Okay, so that's the first part of the question. And then it says describe. And so again, as an upper level math student, you want to try to be as thorough as you can. Okay, so let's kind of have that generally be our, our goal unless we're really in a time crunch. <laughs> So describe the intersection with each of the coordinate planes. What's meant by the coordinate planes is the xy plane is one of the three coordinate planes. The yz plane is a second coordinate plane. The xz plane is the third coordinate plane. That's what's meant by the coordinate planes. My sphere has radius 5 and it has center 2, negative 6, 4. So we're going to do some algebra, but then as we're doing the algebra, we're going to try to picture what's going on also. If I intersect the xz plane, sorry, sorry, the xy plane, if I intersect the xy plane, then z has to be zero. I'm not on the xy plane if z is not zero. So 25 would have to equal x minus y squared plus y plus 6 squared plus 0 minus 4 squared. Okay, if I'm intersecting the xy plane, z has to be zero. So this is, the, I'm doing the algebra that I just said we're, we're going to do, okay? And 25 minus 16 <coughs> is 9, right? So this is a circle in the xy plane with radius, with radius what? What's the radius of my circle? Three. Three. And center two, negative six. If you want to put zero for the z, you can. But, you know, since we're talking about a circle, it's two b. a ball being sliced by the xy plane. Your trace is like where you sliced it, that slice is going to be a circle. Mm -hmm. And this is the actual size of the equation of that circle. So we're going to do similar algebra for the other two. If I intersect the xz plane, then y has to be zero. So that means that 25 would equal x minus 2 squared plus 0 plus 6 squared plus z minus 4 squared. So 25 would equal x minus 2 squared plus 36 plus z minus 4 squared 
And what is 25 minus 36? Careful. Negative 9. Yes. And is it possible to square two numbers that are real numbers and add them together and get negative 9? No. No. So this tells me that there is no intersection because the xz plane is, um, is six spaces from the center of the circle and the radius of the circle is only five. Yeah, you do, C man. Yeah, you do, C man. Plus A, plus A. The fact that it's negative, though, tells me that there's no intersection. Physically, there's no intersection because my, my sphere only had radius 5, and this point, I didn't ask this on the Are You Listening quiz today, but I could have. How far is this point from the XZ plane? It's a distance of 6. For the yz plane, x has to be 0, and so we would get 25 equals 0 minus 2 squared plus y plus 6 squared plus z minus 4 squared, so 25 would equal 4 plus y minus, oops, sorry, y plus 6 squared plus z minus 4 squared, and 25 minus 4 is 21. And so my intersection is a circle in the yz plane with radius square root of 21, and center. Now here you do want to list all three coordinates, because if you only list y and z, somebody's going to think it's x and y. So x is 0, y is negative 6, z is 4. 